Welcome to the Human Meme Podcast. I'm your host, AI David Bowles, and along with our crack bot AI research team, we will discuss Beyond Words, the transformative journey of learning new languages in later life, and together, we will wade into the enriching world of acquiring new languages beyond our youthful years. In our increasingly interconnected globe, the mastery of a second or third language is not merely a skill. It's a portal to understanding, a bridge to diverse cultures, and a testament to the lifelong capacity for growth. This journey, though challenging, offers unparalleled cognitive benefits, cultural insights, and a unique perspective on life. It's about embracing new ways of thinking and opening ourselves to the myriad ways in which our world communicates. Join me as we explore the nuances, advantages, and transformative experiences of this linguistic adventure. Let's start by examining the advantages of this endeavor. Learning a new language later in life is like opening a door to a new world. It's not just about the words and grammar. It's about embracing a new way of thinking, a different culture, and an alternative perspective on life. This process enhances cognitive abilities, keeping the brain active and engaged. It's a mental workout that can improve memory, problem-solving skills, and even delay the onset of dementia. But is it easier or harder to learn a new language as an adult? Conventional wisdom might suggest that children have the upper hand due to their developing brains and their ability to absorb new information like sponges. However, adults possess certain advantages, too. They have a better grasp of their native language, which helps in understanding linguistic structures. Their life experiences and developed learning skills can be powerful tools. Yes, the challenge is real, but so is the potential for growth and achievement. Now, which languages are easiest for an English speaker to master? Languages like Spanish, French, and Italian, which share a similar alphabet and have Latin roots like English, are generally considered easier to learn. On the other hand, languages like Mandarin, Arabic, or Japanese pose a greater challenge due to their unique scripts and grammatical structures vastly different from English. Let's talk about progression. Language learning is often categorized into levels. A1, A2, Basic, B1, B2, Independent, and C1, C2, Proficient. Moving from A1 to A2 could take a dedicated learner a few months. Progressing to B, one might take about a year, and reaching B2 could take another year or more, depending on the complexity of the language and the learner's dedication. Can AI help in this journey? Absolutely. AI-powered language learning tools have transformed the landscape of language education. They offer personalized learning experiences, adapting to the learner's pace and style. AI can help with pronunciation, offer real-time corrections, and even simulate conversations to provide practical speaking experience. Let's consider an example. Imagine Sarah, a 40-year-old professional who decided to learn Spanish. She used an AI language app that adjusted lessons based on her progress. The app helped her with pronunciation and provided interactive exercises that made learning engaging and effective. In a year, Sarah went from basic greetings to having conversations in Spanish, showcasing the potential of AAI in language learning. Learning a new language later in life is a journey filled with challenges, but also immense rewards. It opens up new horizons, keeps the mind sharp, and bridges cultural gaps. With the aid of AI, this journey can be more accessible and tailored to individual needs. So, whether you're 30, 50, or 70, it's never too late to embark on this enriching path. Remember, the goal is not just fluency, but the joy of connecting with others in their own language, understanding their culture, and seeing the world through a different lens. 
Keep challenging yourself. Keep learning and embrace the world in all its linguistic diversity. Consider the story of John, a 60-year-old retired banker who decided to learn Mandarin. Many might have thought this an impossible task given the complexity of Mandarin and John's age. But John's motivation stemmed from a desire to connect with his granddaughter, who was learning Mandarin at school. This personal connection fueled his perseverance. He started with basic phrases, slowly grappling with the tones and characters, which were initially daunting. But as he progressed, John found that his life experiences, particularly his patience and discipline, honed over years in banking, greatly aided his learning. After two years of consistent effort, John was able to have simple conversations with his granddaughter in Mandarin, a feat that filled him with immense pride and joy. This story illustrates a vital point. Motivation and personal connection can significantly influence the language learning process. As adults, we often have clear reasons for learning a new language, be it for family, travel, or professional development. This clarity of purpose can be a powerful driving force. Let's also consider the role of immersion. While AI and digital tools are incredibly useful, there's no substitute for real-life practice. Immersion in a language environment dramatically accelerates learning. For instance, Emily, a 45-year-old graphic designer, learned Italian much faster when she spent a summer in Italy. Surrounded by the language, culture, and people, she found herself picking up phrases and nuances that no app or class had been able to teach her. This immersion not only improved her language skills, but also gave her a profound appreciation for Italian art and history, enriching her personal and professional life. Another aspect to consider is the resilience and patience required in this journey. Learning a language is not a linear process. There are plateaus and sometimes even regressions. It's important to stay motivated and not be disheartened by setbacks. Joining language learning communities, either online or in person, can provide much needed support and encouragement. In the context of our increasingly interconnected world, learning a new language later in life also has broader implications. It's a statement against the ageist stereotype that learning is only for the young. It's a testament to the lifelong capacity for growth and adaptation. When older adults learn new languages, they not only develop new skills, but also promote cognitive health, cultural empathy, and a deeper understanding of the world. To wrap up, the journey of learning a new language later in life is as much about personal growth as it is about acquiring a new skill. It's a path filled with challenges, but also with immense satisfaction and opportunities for deeper human connections. Whether it's through AI-assisted learning, immersion experiences, or community support, this journey can lead to unexpected discoveries and a renewed sense of purpose. To conclude our episode, Beyond Words, the transformative journey of learning new languages in later life, Let's reflect on the rich tapestry of stories and insights we've shared. Like John, who bridged generations through Mandarin, or Emily, who immersed herself in the heart of Italy, each story is a testament to the profound impact of embracing new languages. These narratives are not just about acquiring vocabulary or mastering grammar. They represent a deeper, more meaningful transformation. They show us that regardless of age, we can break through the barriers of language, connecting us to new cultures, new ideas, and new ways of seeing the world. This journey, fueled by personal motivations, resilience, and the aid of AI technology, is a celebration of the enduring human spirit and its capacity to grow and adapt. As we navigate our AI-integrated world, Let's carry the essence of this journey beyond words into a realm where language is a bridge to endless possibilities. 
and where learning is a lifelong quest that continually reshapes our understanding of the world and each other. So, my human meme friend, let's embrace this linguistic adventure with open hearts and minds, and let the transformative power of language learning enrich our lives in ways we never imagined. Thanks for joining us today. For the Human Meme Podcast, I'm AI David Bowles wishing you a gentle morning and a bright evening. Be a human meme.